On any given night, there are more than 600,000 people across the country who are considered homeless. And of that number, more than 62,000 are veterans. An aggressive effort that began back in 2009 has lowered the number of veterans who are homeless. But there was a problem. And new at 6 o'clock, 10 News military reporter Bob Lawrence with how a charity stepped in to correct it. A few months ago, walking with key in hand to his own apartment was not on Daniel Parker's radar. Yeah, I, I feel lucky and blessed. The Army veteran was off the streets, but when he got the keys and moved in, the place was empty. You know, I was just kind of like lonely in a way with nothing. But now it's like a home because I do have everything. That's where Ambet stepped in. They provided a coffee table, sofa, lamp, dining area, and more. I got the bed right here, a brand new bed with the blanket and cheese. Got the dresser. And vets had been associated with the VA for years, but discovered last summer. There was a realization that there's nothing in the house when the veteran moves in. Aside from the furniture, there was also a $100 gift certificate to get things like dishes. Other veterans are in this complex as well. A new approach by the VA and housing and urban development. It's not a VA home that we're letting them stay in or that there's some kind of agreement in that way. It's their home. All we ask is that you work with the case management to maintain that. The effort is part of a goal by VA Director Eric Shinseki, seen here in San Diego two years ago, to end veteran homelessness by 2015. Parker admits his addictions cost him everything. I wasn't able to pay my rent, so I lost my place. And once I got in the streets, it was hard to clean up to find a job. It was kind of like a vicious circle. For a homeless veteran who found himself at stand down last year to now having a place of his own, if this program didn't exist. I know where I'd be. I see we out in the streets. Reason enough, he said, to work hard to keep it. Bob Lawrence, 10 News. Great story. An estimated 2,200 homeless veterans live in San Diego County and vets would like to expand its furniture outreach. And we have a link on our website. Just click on the red television button on 10news.com.